Alright guys, it's a brand new month, so let's go ahead and get into the top 5 decks for May 2024. So first thing to note, box chips have been extended up to the Great Tornado box, so that includes cards like Junk Synchron, Miracle Fusion, Junk Destroyer, plenty of other good cards as well. The Fabled card is here, so I both Fabled cards. I think Fabled could be a good free-to-play deck, but I'm, I'm not too sure on that yet. So there's a few decks like that that I'm not too sold on yet, but uh, we'll see. So our first deck is going to be Amazements. Amazement got some new support from the brand new boxes listed from Happy YRAX, so make sure you guys go check them out. Uh, it is two runs through the old Amazement box, we're going to get into that, and then basically uh, you run all the Ring 4s, like whatever Ring 4s you got, whatever traps you got, just put it in the deck, and it, it's pretty good. So, um, in the new box they got a free-to-play extender, they got a normal card here, uh, the Amazement Assistant Delta, you reveal an Amazement Attraction Trap in your hand, special summon it. And then you can send an attraction trap from your hand or face of the field to the grave to set an attraction trap directly from your deck to your spell and trap card so that you can only use the effect of Amazement Assistant Delta once per turn. So it's pretty good. Free special summon, extender, and then they also got their trap card, the Amazement Attraction Thrill Train. Target one Amazement monster you control or one face up monster your opponent controls, put this card to it. You, you can change the quick monster uh, to battle position, then you can opponent chooses one amazement attraction card in the graveyard and set it. Or if you put it to your opponent, banish the equipped monster until the end phase. So it's basically like a farfa. Pretty good. Um, so you guys can also see in the list, you just run two of the old amazements, uh, which uh, if you go and click through here, I'll show you the box that it is in. Uh, so you just need, I believe it is a, is it a mini or, I'm pretty sure it's a mini box with the Ancient Warriors. Uh, let me check real quick just to be safe. So yeah, you're gonna wanna do two run-throughs of another mini box and one run-through, or not even like one run-through of the other one. So this is like a very cheap deck. It's not gonna be super top tier, but it's gonna be pretty good. I definitely think you get cog with it. So um, definitely check this deck out. Remember, if you don't have like any of the traps, you can replace it with whatever the best traps you have. Or if you have, like, uh, and just place it with the best, like, Rank 4 engines or Nightmare Phoenix and Unicorns, whatever, probably just Phoenix, but, like, whatever you got, just play that. Um, and, yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, just the main amazement cards there. So, the next deck that we're gonna talk about is going to be from... Um, it's gonna be from Duel Links Free to Play. And this, uh, make sure you guys go check out the links for you to play as well. Uh, I'll leave the link to this video in the description. Uh, but Prank Kids are another new deck box that you can play here. So, and they're pretty free to play. This is just one run through the box. Or not run, one run through the box. This is three run throughs of the box, which is a bit of a commitment, but I believe there is, he also has another list, let me see if I can pull it up real quick, with, it's just one run through the box, but it's pretty, I don't know about prank kids, it's kind of, uh, like, it could be good, but it also could be, uh, copium, a lot of copium, but they probably could get a lot of support in the future, if they get a lot of support in the future, then that means they could get um, <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. So then the first one is with three pranks and three. Um, if we go and go ahead and show you guys this real quick. Um, this is another uh, one of his lowest. So you guys can see this one here is a bit cheap on the cheaper side as you guys can see it has only two run throughs of the box for this one fairly good and then this is the three run through and this yeah so you probably don't want to go through the box at least twice to get two of each of those spells for pranks and then king of the swamps should be a box chip card i'm imagining so and then you gotta run the Synchro Storm Race skill. Oh, also for, yeah, Light, uh, Draw Sense Light for the um, Amazement, you could also run Life Point Boost Alpha as well. So 
keep that in mind. So we're gonna go and move on to deck number three. So those are two brand new deck boxes to check out. For deck number three, we have Luna Lights. Luna Lights are not deck build boxes, but <laughs> brand new out of the new box. Luna Light is a deck build box here, and it's pretty, um, I'll, I'll go and show you guys where you need to pull Luna Lights real quick. So if you want to know where you need to pull Luna Lights, um, you're going to go ahead and go over to the, the box over here. You're going to go over to special deck build box, and they're going to be here. Uh, Basically, you can get everything in here except the Raider's Knight and the Ark Rebellion. Those are going to be for the new box. You don't have to play it, but you can. I don't know how much it's going to improve the deck, but this is the newest list, so keep that in mind. It is pretty good. Raider's Knight and Ark Rebellion is pretty good OTKs, but Ludolix have pretty good OTKs already, so they're also running the Bujin, which you probably could replace with like another Fusion if you don't have or something. And it'd be fun. You definitely can call the Ludolix. Uh, it's a pretty good free-to-play deck. So for deck number four, let's go and get into that. We have Stardust. This deck is okay. Shooting Star TG EX is the skill. Um, it's from the older main box. Um, which is Striker Expansion. So if you went through this box. And then Junk Synchron is now free to play. You can pick it up with box ships. So you could technically replace this. You could grab another Junk Converter if you wanted. Um, it's fairly free to play. It's it's going to be a struggle to cog with. But you, I've cogged with this deck before. So, uh, you know, it's possible. It is possible. But it is rough. Not going to lie. Uh, but it's free to play. Especially now that Junk Synchron is box chip and Junk Destroyer is box chips as well. So if you're missing any of those, you can grab those with box chips now. So on to deck number five. Deck number five is going to be the standard 10 ye deck list, uh, the Legend of Heroes list. 10 yees are always going to be on the free to play list, of course. Um, so do keep that in mind. And tennies are going to be in the... Um, it's getting a bit older, but it's the World of Baryon mini box. Still holding its value to today. It's still on the tier list. It might be barely on the tier list, but it is still on the tier list. So, it is a free-to-play deck. Just run through it three times with the new box. You get three Ashunas, three Monks, and... Or not the new box, of the tennie box. Which is... Um, this one right here. The World of Baryon mini box. So yeah, make sure you guys go check that one out. Our next deck, uh, this is some bonus decks here. Um, not tier list, that's an old tier list, guys. Don't, don't pay attention to that. Uh, <laughs> our next deck is gonna be... It's gonna be an interesting one. It is the Evil Eyes. So the one thing about Evil Eyes, right? is there is a card that is um if you didn't pull it it's gonna be a bit rougher because it is from a f event it was like the the wheel event or whatever you call it, the the lap event so if you've been playing duel links and you got the card you can definitely do this free to play it's another deck build box it's fairly good um they're running the synchro storm race skill you can also run it with the um there's a new Xyz skill, I want to call it. I'm going to check and see if it's out yet. We'll see. Um, it is... It should be a lifetime. Uh, I'm not sure if it's out yet. Let me see. Summon 3... No, I don't, I don't know if it's out yet, but there was like, there's like an Xyz skill that you can replace Synchro Storm Rays with. It, but you just basically just do exceeds monsters and it gives you like an, an extra 1600 instead of 1500. So look out for that one. Uh, I'm not quite sure what the skill's called, but if you guys in the comments know, let me know. If you don't know, if you can't find that, you can always do these 
Synchro Storm Worries, just put a Wind Synchro in your extra deck and you'll gain 1500 life. So keep that in mind. But do keep in mind again that the um, Evil Eye Link Monster you are is only through the event so far, so if you don't have that, the deck might not work. So that is another thing to keep in mind. So that brings us to our last deck. Free to play deck number seven, Blue Eyes. So Blue Eyes, one thing is uh, Ultimate Fusion is locked behind a structure deck, so you'll only be able to play one of those. Uh, free to play. And BLS is, if you haven't been playing the game, it was, if you've just come back, uh, BLS is locked behind a event. And we don't know when the um, card is going to be added to tickets. So it is going to be harder without BLS because you need it for Ultimate Fusion. And it also helps with your skills. So, But if you have the BLS, this deck is very free to play. It is uh, very good. The three crackdowns are probably the most expensive part of the deck. And you get the, um, you get one of the, if you got the code redeemed, you'll have a structure deck with a lot of these cards already. With the alternative, the melodies, you get, it gives you triple melody. So yeah. Um, yeah, so that's gonna be it for the top five free to play decks of May, 2024. Let me know if I missed any. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.